We are here. We are here. We made it. I'm only a little bit late, I promise. I'm not that late. I apologize for being late. We had to go pick up my brother from work, and apparently his job decided to hold him up an extra 30 minutes. Ah, but we are here. Hello, everybody. What is up? What is up? What is good? Okay. Confused Ray, Noah, Derek, Dark Ninja, if you guys are still here. Tiny, Joey, Victor. Uh... Dark Ninja, that's a new face. Uh, who else is here? Landstorm. When the team goes, <laughs> what's up? What's up, uh, Landstorm? Oh, and the type of guy to be eating his dinner before streaming is 30 minutes late, and with DCE, a buzzword just as a waste of energies. What was happening? <laughs> Why would you say this? <laughs> this is not the kind of person I am. Dude, I haven't eaten today. I literally, like, the plan was for me to. Uh, ooh, cool. The plan was for me to. Uh, what was it? The plan was for me to go pick up my brother and get food on the way back home and have some time to spare to set up the stream, right? But what ended up happening was my brother, my brother's job held him up 30 minutes, so I actually completely ruined all strategies. So uh, I'm streaming today and I have not eaten. <laughs> I am starving, but it's late anyways. I shouldn't eat. I have to figure out what I'm going to eat tomorrow because I don't have any food for tomorrow. And apparently my job canceled on me, so I'm making less money. And, dude, if you want to know about angry and why I'm angry, bro, I was, a, uh, I was, uh, that Gardevoir video that I uploaded, the bulky Gardevoir video, you guys love that. You guys, you guys destroyed the like goal in the video. And the goal is for me to play, oh, dude. The goal is for me to play Greninja for the, for a video today, but it ended up not happening, and I'll explain why. But more importantly, that Gardevoir video, I made no money off of it because it was demonetized. It's not suitable for freaking... If you guys follow me on Twitter, which you should follow me on Twitter. Or just, no, don't, don't do that. Um, I'm going to change my clothes while I'm talking about this. But, uh, <laughs> <clears throat> but I was... Uh, I'm angry, man. Because my video apparently was demonetized. And I need to learn to start checking my videos. You think when I'm uploading PG content that, like, you know, my video would be suitable for advertisers. But I don't know what's going on right now. My videos are, like, every time I upload a video, it like it's, like, whatever. It's demonetized for, like, a little bit. So I just give it a couple minutes before I publish it. And usually it's, like, monetized again. But this one started out being perfectly fine and throughout the day it's been going back and forth between monetizable and demonetized back and forth every time i refresh the page it's something new i've lost all the money on one of my best videos i've uploaded in a long time and it infuriates me because i'm finally doing decently well on youtube <clears throat> so it's like uh, that's killing me and then i woke up this morning i was like i'm gonna build i'm gonna play green ninja today right so i wanted to do one of those quickie uh, videos where I do like one video one battle uh, one good battle I should say and uh, you know just show you my update your ninja list get the good battle and call it a day from there <sighs> well and the uh, first two matches in a row I had three Froggeteers prized in each match each match I had three Froggeteers prized that first match I had three Froggeteers prized and a Starmie. I was like, whatever, I'm just gonna power through. I can probably get a couple prizes and then win the game that way. But my Starmie was prized. So even with Greninja Break on the field, I was completely boned. And then I was like, okay, you know what? I'm not gonna get mad. We're gonna be okay. I played one more game, two Froggeteers prize. I was like, yep, today is not a good day for Pokemon. So I stopped recording and I just went and did my homework. And oh man, I'm really mad. <laughs> today has been an infuriating day. <clears throat> just absolutely infuriating and like today they canceled my job so that's another 80 bucks just out the window because i was going to work a long day tomorrow because i work long days on the weekend and now i'm losing money left and right which is really bad because one holiday season and two i need to pay for school i need to pay for food i need to pay for like my insurance my phone bills my car bills i have so much to pay for and i'm about to be in crazy debt <sighs> dude no, everything's just going wrong now Anyway, I'm going to play some Greninja and ruin somebody else's day so they know how I feel. I'm just kidding. But I do want to play Greninja. People keep asking me to play Greninja. And uh, I'm going to play it now because people want to see me play it. 
and I didn't get a chance to get a video out there. So now, uh, people that do watch my, I have a lot of people that watch the streams post. So this is a, uh, this is a, this is a way for me to get the video out there for you guys. <clears throat> also like the stream if you haven't already. I have to refresh the page to see how many likes there are. So I actually don't see the chat right now. Also, I have to put all the chat stuff on the board as well. I haven't actually looked at the chat yet, guys. I'm, I apologize. I've been setting up this whole time. That's all there. So there we go. Just look at the opening hand is garbage. It's just not a good day. Everything's just going bad. Anyways, uh, enough of me complaining. I do apologize. I just figured I would give you guys all the uh, information as to why the title says angry. Also, the giveaway is today. So remember, today is the last day you get a chance to donate if you guys want a chance to win any super dope prizes today would be the day uh all right i'll take this it's not a star you like i was hoping it would be um but i will retreat here get that a little bit safer um if you guys want a chance to win uh, i believe the prizes i don't think we reached the full art lele but a couple more dollars could potentially make us re reach the full art lele so if you guys want a chance to win something like a full art top of gx online we're giving away hyper Zoark and hyper so valley today uh secret dce if you guys want a chance to win that if you donate through pay uh through the donation link in the description uh every dollar and is an entry and there's not many people that have entered so far so remember I have to do uh, that is how you do it i also have to do five dollars for each sponsor i do have a list of all the sponsors here so a five dollar entry for every sponsor and uh robert i am not adding brilliant air gardevoir into my gardevoir deck that doesn't even make sense <laughs> all right let's see how many froggy deers are prized this time oh one for i just can't get a break today can i it's fine though it's not the end of the world if this happens i don't want him to knock out star you but I have to water duplicates now because I don't want to draw into any other ones. So if he knocks out Star, Star U, it's whatever. We'll survive, I guess. Anyways, let's see the chat. Uh, yeah, Brilliant Arrow Guardy doesn't make any sense in that fat Guardy list that I uploaded. Because you're usually going to have only one or two energies on the field at a time. And you're never going to have a chance to upload three. You have to build a, a very specific deck for Brilliant Arrow Guardy. And then you put in a one or two Steam Siege Guardy as tech. So, he, okay, I'm very glad he chose to knock that out and not... Okay, that, that actually makes me very happy because <laughs> I, I want to make this a Starmie as quickly as I can. Oh, crap. That makes things kind of awkward. Um, let's... Let's shuffle them back. That does make things a little bit awkward. Uh, hmm... Because now I have to, I was hoping I could sick them more and draw Greninja's before I make that play. But I have to make, I have to do it this way now. Which is a yikes. And this is exactly why I was awkward. Because there's no freaking Greninja's. Now nah, we're done with this game. This game's done. We can't win this game. Not at that rate. <clears throat> Alright. Let's read the chat real quick before we continue on. Uh, oh man. What's up, or what's up, Electrify? I, I was just reading his comment saying what's up, Orbom, so I almost said what's up, Orbom, to myself. Let me uh, continue reading everything before we continue with games. Um, so I'm ruining other people's day with Grand Lol. Once I see no more of this garbage deck, I'll be donating. Oh, I appreciate it, bro. I have to upload it because I've been. People are trying to. Uh, people have been wanting me to play my Greninja deck for a long time, and you know I gotta appease the people that want to see it. It's a good budget deck. But remember the giveaway, guys. I can actually let me see. Oh, I don't have my yeah, dude. You haven't um, I haven't had a chance to or have to go find the cards again to send again because it looks like yours got lost in shipping if you don't have them. Uh, luckily, they're signed cards, so they're really cheap. It's not going to cost me much. It's just I have to pay for shipping again, but that's about it. This time, I'll pay for tracking. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try to sponsor me next month. Hey, thank you so much, Danny Orange. But if you guys haven't liked the stream, I'm, uh, go ahead and do that. But if you guys don't know, Italian Turtle actually donated a very large sum. Uh, he actually donated by giving me ultra rares. Like, he actually mailed me ultra rares, and that was his donation. And because he donated me such a large sum, I was able to send him back uh, signed cards. So if anybody's interested in that, let me know. Because anybody that donates can always get, like, a signed card from me. I never mind. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and try this one more time, and then we'll move on. I'm not just doing Frog State. Actually, today is supposed to be Sil Valley testing. I have, I have test, I've, um, I went to a tournament <clears throat> yesterday. I think it was the League Cup. I don't remember. <laughs> I got some packs at the end of it. 
uh, and I made a fourth, third, it was either, no, I made fourth place, yeah. Um, I was playing Silvalli Metal Toolbox. I actually added a bunch of really fun, creative things to my Silvalli deck, and I was like, you know, I haven't played this deck since I've updated it, so let's have some fun today. What's up, Alex G? How you doing? Yeah, UPS is actual trash. You have never told a lie. The hands today are pretty bad. I don't think I'm going to play Greninja after this. Uh, for all those Greninja lovers, I promise I'll have a Greninja up for you guys at some point. I just, just, I'm just not in the mood to be like, like, if you guys heard the beginning of the stream, you guys know I'm just not in the mood today. <laughs> I'm just not feeling it. Um, <clears throat> but this will be, probably be the last game. Luckily, we have a good matchup here. As long as we can get a decent setup, we should be okay. What's up, Bart? Oh, he's on an NS, which is pretty okay if we can get a, uh, if we can get a uh, another Froakie down. Well, you know what? I'll take this. This is not bad by any means. I just have to play down a bunch of cards, which is a little bit not great. But I have to draw into something, right? We have a Lily, which will get us a couple extra cards. Well, do I Lily or do I Sycamore? I kind of want a Sycamore, but... You know, we'll Sycamore here. Because if I do this, I'm drawing four cards. But if I Sycamore, I'm drawing seven. And we play three Stretchers. I'm just going to play Sycamore. See, that worked out pretty nicely for us. We can uh, actually... Okay, the chances of him knocking me out next turn are fairly low. Because he doesn't play DCE, so he can't like put energies on a Lele. So I'm just going to bubble here. I think I'm pretty okay to make this play. It sucks I'm going to have to Skylar for a draw supporter, which is fine. I can Skylar for a draw supporter, play Ultra Ball, get um, get a uh, Frogadier, and then Water Duplicates, and hopefully they're not all priced. Um, will a $15 donation suffice? Bro, it would make my day. 100%. Like, because, <laughs> like, I'm trying to make enough money to survive and a donation. But, but make sure you don't do it through Super Chat. Super Chat's the devil when it comes. YouTube right now is the devil, bro. It is being gross. But if anybody's interested in a map, first of all, peep the Twitter if you're... Oh, this is actually gorgeous. <laughs> peep the Twitter if you're not part of the Twitter. Um, I need a draw support for next turn. So, oh, my last Sycamore. Yikes. What do I have in my hand right now? You know, this is actually pretty decent. Um... I can actually get Star You right now if I want to, which I kind of do want to. Let me get Star You here. <laughs> I don't know what my Pokemon line is. If you guys don't know, I have my mats here. Let me actually show you guys a picture of my mats. For anybody that's interested, uh, these also count as donations, but I have my Orbomb play mats here. We still have them on sale. The week isn't over, so we are selling them for $22. Um, I am going to toss this and a splash because I can only attach one per turn. So this should work out pretty nicely. We get a star you here, and we have all of our frogadiers. Okay, so this is gonna be it's, it's of course the the bad the the 50 50 matchups we don't get anything, but in this matchup we're getting something. I can't complain too much, but it's still like you know yikes. There we go. <clears throat> did I just go back in PTCGO time, dude? You did. No, this deck is still good. It's just not being playable. Right? It's not played too much right now because of Galissapod's popularity. Once Galissapod stops being popular and there's a lot more Volcanion in the meta, Greninja will rise again. It's just kind of like how tournaments go, right? You play a tournament. Uh, I have the tweet out there. We're tweeting streaming, by the way. I haven't done that yet. If any, if uh, if somebody could put in the Discord, that'd be really nice. Um, but it's just how it goes, right? Like one deck gets popular, it gets counter decked. You see a lot more of the counter deck, and then that counter deck in the next tournament will be counter decked. So I'm assuming in like a couple of months, Greninja will be popular until Volcanion dies off. It's just gonna be one of those things. Streaming, ranting, playing Soul Valley mostly. Come hang. By the way, guys, how's the audio sound? I don't think there's any background music yet, so I have to turn that up because I forgot that I do that whenever I... Because when I record, I have to change my audio settings. What did he do? He just... Oh, he was, this man is stuck. This man is stuck at Rooney's. Ooh, this is actually kind of clean, right? We have a Greninja down there. Hey, that's pretty nice. Let's get another Greninja in hand. Uh, this is actually a perfect hand here. I just only took a couple... only took, like, what, two games? Uh, but, like, to be fair, I also rage quitted two of the games. Uh, we'll do this. Let's take more here. More frogs. Uh, choice band, you can keep that choice band, buddy. Only th I only don't like that I don't have a Starmie yet. But this will do. We will Shadow Stitch so we can't use Lele. And let me see the chat again, because apparently I minimized my chat for some reason. Alright.
So I'm still on vacation. I'm too lazy to reopen Discord. Oh, dude, speaking of vacation, I need to. Oh my god. $15 is making your day. Might as well make your night too. Hey, 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 Electrify. Joining the donation squad. I appreciate you, big dog. I really do. Let me go ahead and put $16 into your name for the monthly giveaway. Um, remember, we are going to be announcing that tonight if anybody's interesting, interested, I should say. Um, so far, let me actually see if we've reached 100 now. With uh, 16. It's my boy. My boy. So we're at... Uh, 20 25 32 is it my turn yet no he's Guzman. i'm gonna let him make this play 32 52 62 63 67 68 looks like we're at 78 guys cool so we're really close Twelve dollars away, and we'll be able to. I think the. Let me double check my uh, my notes, but uh, tier prize will be a hundred dollars with a full art tapule. Yep. Once we hit a hundred dollars, um, there is a full art tapule coming. Yo, way way, baby. That was really cringy. I apologize. Uh, <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have attached that yet, but whatever. Do we blow her? We do not blow her. I should blow her though, just to get it out of my deck, because I'm probably not going to use it. <clears throat> we'll just end here. We'll give him more cards. We'll give him the chance. Shout out to you guys, though, for all the epic support and epic donations. And yeah, this is exactly why I didn't want to do what I did last turn. <laughs> Yikes. But we do have an amazing field here. We can take a prize. I don't want to take a prize yet, but I will actually just knock out a Matang because why not? I just hate that we don't have Starmie yet. But the more Matangs we can knock out, the better we'll be. Ultra Ball, there we go, now we have a Starmie. Uh, I won't play it yet, but we'll have one for next turn. Uh, Victory Arceus, what's up? Who's Allison Ninetales? I like that comment. Can he play Myelotic today? Uh, Myelotic, probably, we'll see. For now, I just I got to show off the consistency. For now, we're just gonna go ahead and move on. So I'm not gonna show you guys my Soul Valley deck yet. I just want to play it, and then if we get good wins, I'll show you. If we don't get good wins, it's a secret forever because it's embarrassing. <laughs> I might play some Decidueye Zoric as well, just because I want to work on my Decidueye Zoric build. I want to work on my builds today. Today I haven't. I wanted to make a competitive day on like. Wednesday or Thursday, but because I haven't been able to stream the days that I want to just because of life stuff I had to cancel them and I want to make it today that way we can do focus tomorrow on viewer matches So come back tomorrow if you guys want viewer matches and we might even do some viewer matches near the end My hero academy is amazing. Say it again for the people in the back. Mr. Friday say it again. That is the goat series, bro Even train my dancey while, while watching or bro the anti is actually one of my favorite Pokemon as far as like megas go and everything like that So it's a good it's a good one this opening hand is pretty good if I was going first, because I could bridge it, actually. And they could look at what's prized, potentially play Gladi on the following turn. This hand is actually not bad by any means. Don't spend any money that you shouldn't. Well, I'm not... Oh, no, 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 no. No, the, uh, the tracking is really cheap. Don't worry about it. It's like just... I think I even have, like... Ooh, this is kind of awkward. Uh, this is actually really awkward for me. Bulu is one of our worst matchups, because Bulu is one of the few decks that can hit 110. So I have to figure out how I'm going to work around this. Um, no, don't worry about me spending money on shipping. It's actually super cheap. I can just get pocket change and pay for it. Um, I just have to go. I just have to drive over to the place. That's the only thing that's annoying about it. But it's not even a big deal. So I wouldn't worry about a big, big dog. You know, it's amazing to me that, like, my streams are more... Oh, my God, top decks. My streams are more advertiser-friendly than my, uh... <laughs> ooh. Ooh, look at that. Uh, well, his Pokemon aren't weak to fire, so playing that doesn't really matter right now. Uh, Bulu might come in clutch. I mean, not Bulu, Necrozma, so I'm going to keep that in mind. Oh, I didn't look through my deck like I wanted to. I'm going to have to do that next turn. E-Hammer is completely worthless. But for now, I'm just going to pass. I do need a draw sport next turn. But this is worthless, except for the GX attack, which I can play stretcher for later. And this is worthless, and we're going to try to play draw sport next turn. So let's see what happens. Um, 
How did you say 69? Did I say 69? How do you watch a Greninja player? How do I watch a Greninja player? <laughs> hey guys, drop a like for me not playing Greninja anymore. Early Christmas for my boy Ori, so is Lele online and our, it's all, all everything's online, unfortunately. Once I get like once because ideally right i get a bunch of donations and i can actually pay for irl giveaways because i have irl giveaways i can give away but you know i have to have the money to do it first what's happening this man is having a really rough start um okay so let's see what's prized first before we do anything else because i don't have an energy so i'm gonna have to get an energy the question is though do i get the energy with uh with this baby Let's see, we have all of our Zoraks. How many Soul Valleys? We have one, so we also need to get a Soul Valley this turn as well. Uh, but we don't have any Metal Energies in the discard pile yet. We need a lot here. What is prized? We have all of our DCEs. We have, a, I think, two, maybe one or two Metal Energies prized. Uh, I think we have a Choice Band prized. We have like two Memories prized. So we have a lot of Memories prized, which is fine. We don't need the Memories. All right, so Gladion's worthless this game. Let's just go ahead and stick to the Draw Sporter then. I kind of want to play another type null down because I don't need any other backup attackers this game. We can actually just GX here to get a big knockout if I feel like I need to. Because <clears throat> this thing's annoying. It's already set up. I want to make sure it's gone. So ideally we get Sil Valley and a, any energy here. No, play, DCs was not what I was talking about, but we're going to have to we're going to have to play the DCs to make this work, which sucks. Ace Rollers are only good. No, Ace Rollers aren't really good this game either. Field blowers are going to be great, though. Uh, I think we're going to have to lose the Mallow here. I hate that we have to attach DC to make this work, but you got to do what you got to do, big dog. got to do what you got to do. Because I have to GX here and get my prize. I don't have a reason to use my first attack anyways, because there's no metal, there's no energies down there. <clears throat> now, he does have a way to set up another one, but I'm not going to have any opportunities to just use a powerful GX attack like this again. Because he'll he'll uh, get he'll get the idea of it. Yeah, I don't need these memories at all. Hopefully, we get like a sick more or something. But what's up, Joey? If I haven't said hi to you yet, let me know. Uh, play Desi Garb, Decidui Garb. <laughs> Not like you need your abilities. You're right, bro. <laughs> the Fate series is fire facts. Or we're gonna get. Or we're gonna get, hold on, hold up, pull up. Or we're gonna get demonetized anyways. Regardless of what we do, dude. The streams though are usually fine. Maybe like I like I don't know. We'll see with time. But like I've had to only re-monetize a stream one time. Every other time it was it was like, whatever. Like it's always no matter what we do on the stream, it's usually fine. But it's just the YouTube, which are 100% controlled and 100% monetizable, that end up that way. It's really infuriating. What's with the ho oh The ho is for a powerful friend called Glissopod. Because it's only one fire energy, it's easy enough to set up. You actually just, you you set up twice with it with turbo, you attach a DC and you get Okos on Glissopods. And if you're playing Choice Band, I've been seeing a lot more, at least in my area, Metagross and Sogaleo. So you attach a Choice Band, you Oko Sogaleos as well, which is why I'm playing Choice Band again. What's up, GMU bro? It's been a minute. Uh, 30 stream, 30 viewers in 20 minutes. Hey, tell it again. Hey, shout out to the, shout out to the viewers, man. You guys have been killing it lately. Go, don't forget to drop a like if you haven't already. What's up, Bad Crow? How you doing, Big Dog? Did you knock me out? No, you didn't knock me out. All right, that's fine. Um, and now I wish I had Ace Roll. This actually, this hand is actually pretty nice, though. I am going to probably Guzma this, but I don't knock it out, which is kind of awkward. That's the only thing I don't like about this deck, is, like, you can't actually knock out everything. I will probably knock out the draw supporter. We'll see. Let me do this first before I make any other play. We can manually attach this here. We don't really need you. I want to play N. I want to play Guzma this turn as well. I think I will trade. Just because we have Zorak now, I don't mind if we get N, but I do want to knock this thing out back here because it's a problem. It is a threat. Mm. But at the same time, I kind of want to attach it. Another thing I could do here is get another Zoark, but I want to still Valley. I could also wait, but if I wait, I'm going to be in an awkward position. But I also want to manually attach. But I can. I don't know. There's so many things I want to do here. This was Ultra Ball. We'll see what happens. I might just manually attach the Zoark as well. 
I mean, not manly attach, but put the energy onto Zoark and focus on that for a little bit. We'll see. How many, what do we have left in the deck? <clears throat> we have like two Guzman sprites, I gotta keep that in mind as well. Yeah, I definitely don't want to knock this thing out so he doesn't get any funny ideas. Hmm. I'm just trying to think, do I attach here or do I attach to, uh, to the Zoark instead? I really want to risk attaching it here and hopefully get a DCE, but I can't rely on that. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and attack and attach to the Sil Valley. There is Zoark. No. Ah, uh, do I? Um, uh, you know what? I'm going to play risky. Do I play risky? I mean, regardless, I need an energy next turn, but I have to wait, waste an attack. Hmm. I'm in the air about it right now. Because I'm losing like two or three turns if I attach here. If he gets knocked out, but this will not lose me a lot of turns. So, but that's relying on me getting the DCE between trade and N. I'm not sure if I'll get it. Maybe I should play special charge. I think I will attach here. Yeah, I think that's oh, oh whatever. Uh, oh, show cards. My bad. Uh, done. Mm, this will put me damage on the board. But we need follow-up damage as well. I guess another Zora could potentially be follow-up damage. This doesn't. This is not the worst idea. We got choice band as well. All right, cool. This game is going fast. I guess I'm not even paying attention because I'm trying to read the chat. What's up, Helio Lux, bro? Nice to see you. How much longer are you gonna be streaming? I just got off work. I mean, I just started, so hopefully another hour. He does knock me out, which is awkward. Luckily, he knocked me out with Bulu, but the unlucky part is that if he gets a choice band here, we're kind of boned. So hopefully he doesn't have choice band. Because once again, this is literally our worst matchup. Luckily for... Oh, this is actually an amazing top deck. Luckily for us, um, we don't really need fire energy, so we can actually get, use these now. Luckily for us, uh, we can end him down to four. What does this choice band do? Without, uh, you know, I kind of want to attach it to Lele. Let's do that. Let me trade this now, because we want energies in the discard pile, for the most part. Stretcher is pretty nice. Choice Band is okay. I don't think I want to attach Choice Band right now, though, so I will just end. Stretcher is, mm, it gives me a Sil Valley, but I don't want to, I don't want a Sil Valley there. Yeah, I'm just going to play it. Uh, and for now, I can use Stretcher to get something like Lele or Zoark back if I need to. So this is okay. I like Guzma because it gets me another prize, potentially. For now, I will just attack with this. We'll just be here. I have to practice this deck, which is why we're going to be playing this a lot more. Because this deck is very toolboxy, which means it needs a lot of practice. Um, the Ron Aragon, like, uh, dude, Aragon's dope. It was one of my favorite books to read when I was younger. Boy, or you want too much, dude? I know, right? I'm a needy man. Would a deck using a little Nine Tails to counter GXs be somewhat viable? Sure. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that idea. You just have to be careful that you have workarounds for other common. Pokemon that like help Let's see uh, okay so he's gonna fully heal here which makes it kind of awkward Ace Roll would be really nice right now I'm not gonna lie now it'd be a really good time for Ace Roll but we also need Pokemon and energies and stuff down so it's also really awkward I can get he can get another two prizes off this but I'm not too sure how I want to approach this yet I want another Zoark down I want DCE I want a lot of things here Ace Roll is here but I can't attack if I use Ace Roll right now that's the issue because I have, I could trade again and bank on getting a DCE. I think denying knockouts is just really important. So I will ace roller here, even though it's not ideal. I can at least bank on something. I haven't retreated for the turn yet, so this actually works out. I can do this, this. 
Uh, we'll see if I manually attach yet. I think I will get rid of N. Maybe. Maybe get rid of an energy. I know I have more energies in the deck, so I think I'm pretty safe to get rid of an energy. Because I might want to keep the supporters in case he ends me. We didn't get DC, which sucks. But this gives me a turn I can attach a metal energy here and just kind of feed him type null for now. I could feed him Tapu Lele and he, he has to work on getting a... No, he, he actually knocks out Tapu Lele from full. Never mind. Uh, yeah, I think what I'm going to do is just pass for now. I'll just pass for now. We'll feed him type null. Yeah, we'll just feed him type null. Now we have to bank on getting a DC. Okay, now the odds of us getting a DC are a lot higher than they were before. Let's see if he has Guzma. If he has Guzma, he can knock out Lele, which is just stretcher food for me. As well, I can get Lele back into my hand. Or back into the deck more than anything. Probably put Kartana. Because once if I can knock this out, I win with Kartana, right? So that's the goal. Are we playing Coco today? Actually, we could play Coco today. Just because it's been a minute since we played Coco, I don't really mind helping and getting a Coco out. But we'll, we'll wait, because once again, I, I did announce this stream. We're going to be mainly playing Type Null today. It's, I mean, Soul Valley today. I made a last year. Hey, what's up, Fire? Dude, nice to see you. He's in a... Okay, so now I have to play N. Which is all fine and good as long as I can, like... Does he have Choice Band? I was surprised he didn't get Choice... I mean, I'm surprised he didn't save that to get a Choice Band. We really, really need to get this, uh... This DCE, bro. Oh, we got second. Okay, that's gonna help out so, so, so much. Alright. So I'm gonna... Do I burn this field blower? I know he's gonna have Choice Bands. That's the, that's, the, that's the thing that concerns me the most, right? So I don't think I want to burn the field blower yet, but I have to play N so he doesn't have Guzma in hand. Uh... So I'm just going to play N first, and then we'll trade what we get. Hopefully we get a DC. Clean. Fine. Okay, we can trade this Ho-Oh because we're not going to use it. <clears throat> we can start getting stuff into our hand. Finally got a DC, which means I can at least start setting up Pokemon in the back. Sycamore, another Soul Valley. Uh, I can put down... Because I know I play two stretchers, so I can't put down a Type Null right now. Just to have a second Soul Valley on the bench. And I can start setting up Soul Valley number two. So I like that play. I can save my trade for the time being and start setting up Soul Valley. And yep. I'm pretty decent. I'm a pretty big fan of this play. How many Soul Valley? We should have one more Soul Valley left, but I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to go ahead and Turbo Drive and attach the Soul Valley on the bench. Please do not have Choice Band or a way to get Choice Band. Please and thank you. The how... Or uh, describes every card with food or fodder. Dude, we're just going to feed him, bro. Is, is that not a thing? I mean, that's my thing, bro. <laughs> Luke, I am your fodder. That's some delicious stretcher food. Yum, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> I love you guys. You guys are legitimately the best. I swear, every time I have a bad day, I can just come home to a tasty stream and be all like, mm. oh, he's just going to knock me out here. But luckily, uh, we get a return knockout and a Kartana game as long as he doesn't get choice band we should be pretty actually even if he does get choice band actually let me think about this one two three four five six seven seven no there's no way he's going to be able to knock out there's no way i have to evolve this right now but there's no way he'll be able to knock me out of the lele right i have to think about this i am not putting that down because fear all right hold up in order for him to hit 210 he needs to have 12 energies to hit 220. He needs, or 10 energies and a choice band. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh, this, it's possible. And that's terrifying. I need to get Field Blower right now. Oh, thank God I saved it. Yeah. Because if he gets two Vicka Volts down, uh, he could have got, he could have got it. He could have got the 10, which is what terrifies me the most. Uh, I need my other things as well. I'm not going to toss Necrozma. Necrozma. I haven't manually attached yet, so I can manually attach the Sylvalia over here. Okay, there's our, there's our, ooh. Hold up. I'm not manually attaching then. Because that manual attachment is going to come in clutch later. Let's Ultra Ball away. The, I'm just trying to thin out as much as I possibly can. Grab a Lele. Thinning. Thinning, thinning, thinning. 
I can even toss Guzma here for the sake of thinning. Because once again, all I want is stretch every game. I think I'll toss N. No, I might keep N. No, I'm just not. I'm, whatever, I'm just going to pass here by turbo driving. I really, really hope he doesn't get two Vicka Bolts down and no shenanigans ensue. Because I win next turn with Kartana. There's another Guzma and another Metal Energy. Okay, let's see. Thanks, Aura. Love you too. Hey, that's my boy, Victory Arceus. Ar Victory Arceus, can I ask you, how do you prefer to say it? Do you prefer Arceus, Arceus, or Arceus? Does he have Choice Man in hand? Because if he has Choice Man in hand and it wins, I'm going to be really mad. I just want to let you guys know right now. He needs, once again, 12 energies between us. He can get 4 more, 5 more at most, which means 8, 9, 10, 11. No, he just needs 11. Oh my god. If he has a manual attachment, there's no way he has a manual attachment in hand, as well as everything that he has here. And enough energies in the deck, because he's already burned through a bunch of energies. There's just no way. I, f I refuse to believe it. Yeah, he already has 5 energies in the discard pile, 3 on the field. That's 8, right? I don't know how many decks Bikaboo, how many energies Bikaboo play, but he would need to have all of his remaining energies and a manual attachment in his hand. And he's going to Ultra Ball away cards in his hand as well, so he needs quite a bit here. Good morning, Portuguese bro. It's been a bit. If I, have, if I haven't said hi to you yet, let me know, guys. 300 damage is clean, pretty much. I prefer if you call victory Arceus. Arceus. Okay, Arceus. That's how you're supposed to say it. At least now with like the Arceus, the RKS system, it should be. We know that it should be pronounced that way. Papa, you yeah, I already GX. I'm not worried. Oh, you. Oh, you're right. Oh, this is a problem. I just realized. <laughs> thank you guys for letting me know. Uh, yeah. So, oh, he's attaching here instead. Okay. Thank you guys for letting me know. I'm definitely gonna have to end my opponent down. Yeah, we can't. We can't make that play because we already GX this game. So, ideally, I Guzma this for game then, right? As long as he doesn't get heavy ball for what's it called right now, we should win. Oh my, did he just win? He just won. That sucks. Oh well, I lost anyways. I didn't think he'd have like a Bulu ready to go. Yikes. I mean, once again, worst matchup. Not not many decks in hit 210 on one attack. So that sucks really bad. At least not for that easily. Alright, cool. Um, Yeah. That sucks. That's the only thing I don't like about like the Sil Valley deck is that whenever you need to hit that number, luckily Vikabu is bad right now, so there's that there's that benefit. But whenever you have to hit those numbers, man, um, like it's hard to hit it because you can't hit 150. You're you're like capped at 120. Like I guess I could play Celestila to hit those bigger numbers, but I'm not too sure how I feel about it. Celestila. Like, Celestia can hit, what, 130? <laughs> Never mind, it doesn't even matter. Uh, 30 damage for each of their retreat costs and your opponent's Pokemon. So how much would how much retreat does Victim Bolt have? If, they were, if we were to, like, theoretically, uh, 3. So that's, like, 30, 60, 90 extra damage. Which is still not a knockout, huh? It's okay. Once, we, once, once they print that... Uh, Dawn Wings Necrozma. It'll work out a lot better. I'm gonna just break Typhlosion because YOLO. You're right. Dude, what's up with all these buckets, bro? I thought the bucket meme died. <laughs> I thought the bucket meme died. Yeah, I don't know. Like, uh, this one can hit 150 if my opponent has one prize left. So I guess there's that benefit. Um, I guess... Ho oh can knock out Vickabolt in one hit, so maybe I should have tried to do that. Um, I think I think they're weak to fire. No, they're weak to fighting. Never mind. Uh, so that doesn't work either. Okay, for the new metal deck, dude, I can. That deck looks stupid, broken. It actually looks ridiculously broken. <clears throat> I could like stack a bunch of energies on this and hit for 150. <laughs> There's that possibility, right? I might have to make that play a little bit more often than I do already. Okay, so we play seven basic energies and four DCs. I know, I, I just remembered I had to cut one energy um, just to fit in all the things I want to fit in. Look how, look how like, fat and busy this deck is. Like, this deck is just, it's just a party right now. The goal is to me for me to figure out what I like and don't like. I know that after, after playing the tournament, 
the Ho-Oh and the Choice Bands came in clutch, bro. Clutch. This Ho-Oh just won me multiple games because there was a lot of Glyph Pod there. So I was able to just Oko Glyph Pods back and forth. Uh, and Because, like, this deck, right, is uh, is meant for the Glyph Pod Garb, the Glyph Pod uh, Zoark meta. Because that's why we're playing three Ace Rollers. We are kind of, like, making the same strategy they are, where we're just kind of Ace Roll and Guzma spamming. But instead of attacking for one energy, we're attacking for three while accelerating. And we have a lot more options because we can uh, attach multiple different Pokemon. We have a GX option here, a G op GX option here for vol Volcanian matchups. We have uh, this match, this card that does Oko's Glyph Spots and, is, oh, and exactly avoids Glyph Spot knockouts unless they GX, which is really nice. Of course, Zoark is Zoark. Um, so Valley has a really strong GX on Rebel, Rebel that gets you a free knockout. <sighs> I, I cut out a field blower just because Garbodor is a lot less popular nowadays, so I don't have to worry about it as much as I used to. Um, I want to play more Bridget. I am playing this because, as you can see, there's a lot of one ofs, two ofs, cards that could be prized that you would love to get. Instead of like playing a card that can search through your deck, you can just play the Gladion and get the exact card. There's so many situations where I'm just like, I would love a DC right now, but instead of having to draw for it, I just lay the Gladion and get it off my prizes, or like, oh, I really want this tool because it wins me the game gladion lele gladion get all the prizes that kind of thing it's really really dope i'm playing two e-hammers because e-hammers are a little bit broke right now there's a lot of things i want to record another video with this deck list just call it still valley toolbox but i don't know we'll see we'll see in the future or is so judgmental or buckets didn't die you died i did die <laughs> ah good meme <laughs> drinks bleach bleach can is full of water if you need heavy hitting cards, play Necrozma, Metagross, Sogaleo, pretty much. But once again, for the, for this deck, you want to play basics, which is why I'm really excited for the Dawn Wing or Dusk Man Necrozma, because that's gonna just fit him beautifully in this deck. Unless it's Bonkai. I love how Aura says it's been a minute, dude. It has been a minute, bro. I love how you guys all love the way I say things. You know, I just love that. Peaches are dude. Peaches are delicious, bro. Uh, anyways, let's go ahead and play some more games with this deck. Let's get some testing in. <clears throat> and guys, don't forget to drop a like. Remember, at the end of today's streams, we are giving away some cards. Actually, you know, I have to show you guys the cards. I feel bad if I don't show it to you guys. So we are twelve dollars. We are twelve dollars worth of donations away from giving away this uh, right here. This top of the fuller on PTCGO. We are one hundred and twelve dollars away from giving away this one. But I tell somebody tells we're not going to reach that tonight. Um, we have that. What other cards we're giving away tonight. We are giving away my remaining Hyper Ray Zoark. And if we do reach the $100, we'll probably give away another Zoark as well. We are giving away... Why do I have three of these? <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know why I have that many. Um, God, I wish I could get one more Sil Valley Full Art. If anybody has a Sil Valley Full Art, let me know. We can try to work out a trade for it. But uh, I want to I want to full art so I don't so I don't have to create I don't have to like go crazy with the OCD, but I think we'll give away one of these if we can hit the uh, 150 dollar goal. We'll try that. But more importantly, the cards that we are giving away today are beautiful secret energies, including this one. This is the big one we're giving away today. This is definitely being given away today, no matter what goal we hit. So remember, if you want to donate for a chance to win, there we go. But let me check to take a look. Um, play. Is this the only? Oh, that's because I have double. That's right. I have all of these other secret energies that I do plan on giving away soon. Uh, counter energy is going to be giving away a different day. But today, I want to give away dark and metal. All right? So dark and metal today. We can give away psychic the next stream. Uh, or next month, I should say. But those are all the cards I am planning on giving away today. Um, <clears throat> I forgot that we opened up three Hyperso values in, that, in the first pack opening. <laughs> Completely forgot about that. Uh, but yeah. I'm hyping me up some Magazone Duskman, dude. I'm excited for that deck. It remind it's like it's like a better Vikabulu. <laughs> In my opinion at least. We got a sixteen dollar donation, man. That's super hype for me. I do appreciate you, Electrify, bro. So if you guys want to stick around to the end of the stream, I think I'll go ahead and time this one. So let's just say in 40 minutes, right? In 40 minutes, so eleven PM Central Standard Time, we will do the giveaway. So if you guys want a chance to donate, even if it's like a dollar, it does help me immensely. I'm also trying to work towards going to Dallas Regionals. So there's that benefit as well. Ooh, awkward, awkward, awkward start. Um, super awkward start, actually. Hopefully I can top deck a Pokemon I can attach this DC to. 
What's up, Tank? Zorg. Oh my god. What's new? Yeah, Dusk main, Dusk main zone. Don't let me get in my zone. Yeah, it just, it just seems like a stronger Vikabulu. You have a way harder hitting attack. Um... With a met with a with a stadium that gets them out of your discard pile. That's the only thing that I feel like is weaker is that it gets them out of your dis discard pile instead of your deck. If it was out of your deck, it'd be so strong. But then you'll take one of those decks that you're only going to be rocking with late game, which is a little bit unfortunate. I don't know what he's playing. Probably Glispod. No, he's playing Decidua. Ooh, this is going to be really awkward. So we're going to need that. Uh... Oh, this is really bad. Let's see what we can get out of this. Okay, at the very least we got type null. Yeah. Oh. Tank just subscribed. Hey, shout out to you, man. Everybody, everybody, shout out to say shout out to Tank for joining the Aura Army. Go ahead and hit him with a welcome. So hopefully he doesn't set up too well because if he does, it's a little bit awkward. Luckily our Pokemon are not, you know, <laughs> 60 HP. We have Fighting Memory and we have Ho. -Oh. So we're gonna try to set up a Ho. -Oh. Choice Bandit Ho -Oh will do the work. Um, and we have Fighting Memory as well that can take care of these Zorix. He's playing the Evo Soda build. I'm not the biggest fan of the Evo Soda build. But it's, it's not bad by any means. It's just not like the way I like to play. How much money do you need to get to Dallas? Uh, so I have to pay... I believe it was $60 for rooming. And then I have to pay for the actual thing. It's $100. Um, then the gas as well. I don't know. I'm thinking like 110 115 Something around that. Something... Something around the lines of that. Do I Ultra Ball here? Or do I discard the energy? I think I kind of want to. I don't want to attach Choice Band. No, I do not. I don't want to do that. Because I want Fighting Memory here. Let's go ahead and get Soul Valley first. Yeah, I think I have to lose this Choice Band. It's fine. Uh, but uh, do I play it Risky? That's the next question. What's price? Oh, we already know what's priced. Um, I have both Fighting Memories. I think uh, mm, I'm going to really regret if I don't attach this energy in a whiff. So I think I will just attach. It's a lot less risky this way. Uh, this card, this GX attack, might come in super clutch this game. So I'm going to try to set up that Necrozma this game. Uh, I'm very glad. I'm very, very glad this is the outcome. Because I get a free knockout here. <clears throat> I just hate that we don't have any Zoros or anything like that. But boom, bam, shablam. Turbo drive for knockout. Uh, yeah, I got you. Boom, boom. Another Savali and another Gladion's back. I don't think there's anything I need from that Gladion. Ideally, I just keep getting, I get some Zoros here. Shout out to Tank. Shout out to Tank. That's my boy. So, because you seem cool into Hey, thanks, Tank. I appreciate you, big dog. <laughs> you die. All right, I'm just in there. <laughs> there are children. Oh God, the children. So he has two Decidueyes out already, which is just absolutely terrifying. And I have no Zoarx out. But oh my, if he gets a third Decidueye, I'm kind of boned as far as getting out Zoarx this game. I got another Soul Valley, which is kind of cool. But uh, hey, I'll take it, bro. I will 100%, excuse me, 100% take that. Shout out to Soul Valley putting in the work. That's another thing I wanted to do. I wanted to play more Fighting Memories just because of like how good it is in this meta. I this is why I'm excited about Savali, which is why I want like my three Hyper and Savalis because Savali is going to meld, just mold to the meta nonstop, bro. No matter what's being played, Savali will find a way to make it work just because of how stupidly versatile it is and how toolboxy of a deck it can become. So I'm really excited about that. Where do I live? I live in the Houston area. Uh, this is a little bit awkward. I'll lead Kartana. Do I lead Kartana? Because I can just do Lele here and just play Bridget. You know what? I'll stop that just in case he ends me. I want to be able to... <clears throat> I won't do that because in case he ends me, I want to be able to get Lele Bridget. This gives me less of a chance. More Zoarks. Oh, speaking of Bridges. Okay, he won't end me this turn, which is cool, I guess. Let's see what my opponent's playing this time. 
and we can actually check the prizes this time. I got, I got like, I think I'm gonna just create a notepad here to where I can write down all my prizes because uh, I gotta know these things. Plus, it's good practice. I just, I hate, like, I, uh, is there a way to where you can, like, make your deck a, all, like, shuffled? Like, if you were to look through your deck, it wouldn't give you a number. Because so I would love the practice of being able to look through my deck and figuring out what's prized. My sister lives there. Hey, that's dope, bro. Wipe your... Uh, don't be a silly. <laughs> I get it. I was... Fantastic. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Oh, we're playing Lycanroc, Zoroark, and Standard. Oh, this is actually really good. Because it means I can get two Zoroas, two, so two Type Nulls. Um, let's see what's prized. We have both Zoroarks. We have all of our Silver Valleys. Um, we have that Kobali. And we have all of our Pokemon, except for a Lele. One Lele is prized. Uh, we have a Acerola. No, we don't have Acerola prized. We have all of our Guzmas. We have a Ananus Sycamore prized. Uh, we have all of our choice bands. We have a DCE prize and a couple of metal energies prize. Let me write this down. So Lele, DCE. I believe that is two metal. So that's four of our prizes. Uh, what else is prize again? Oh yeah, and in a and in a sycamore. So this is actually perfect. Cool. I know all my prizes now. So now we know if we want to play Gladion, I can get a DC off Gladion. I can get an energy off Gladion. I can get so many things off Gladion now with relative ease, which is really exciting. I have so many good things I can get off Gladion. <laughs> Draw Supporter, two Metal Energies, a DC, and a Lele. That's so good. Especially next turn where I kind of want a Metal Energy, but at the same time I want to throw away some, so it's like, it's so weird. We don't have any of the, what's it called, pr uh, prize though. None of the the belt in this deck you want things prized it's so funny i've never had that situation before but i was really hoping we would have oh that's awkward uh, i was really hoping we would have a couple of uh of the fighting memories prized because that way i could just uh just play lele gladion attach and attack for knockout but unfortunately it's just not gonna be the case luckily he can't get any easy knockouts on us unless he evolves into like rock here uh, I believe he was going first, so if he evolves on the Lycan Rock and gets a full bench and knocks out Type Null, I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> I'm gonna be super sad. I'm one of those Zooms who still love Buzzwell Garb. Hey, Buzzwell Garb is good, bro. Or it's Lycan Rock. That's what I said, right? Oh, Le yeah, well, I mean, Lycan Rock is obviously good, but <laughs> I'm, I'm not too worried about it. Just because we have so many targets otherwise. Got some stuff up my chest. <laughs> Very happy for you, Italian. My boy Turtle. By the way, guys, don't forget to like the stream if you have not already. It is always greatly appreciated. How's the stream looking? It looks like the stream's looking good. Oh, that's awkward. Alright, so he's attaching there, which means no knockouts this turn. Which means we're going to need a lot of Pokemon. Hmm... I hate that I have this now. I get it for 100 damage on something. Doesn't seem very useful though. I'll attach here. I kind of want to end because I want to preserve literally all of these cards. But I think I can get away with the Sycamore here. I just hate it. We have one of each draw supporter price. We're down to two draw supporters each. Okay, we didn't whiff Sil Valley. We didn't whiff an energy. We can actually get a Zoric here as well. I just, mm, if I get Zoric, I can't guarantee anything next turn. Stretcher gets me a Lele back, right? I could try to abuse that. Hmm. I didn't get, I didn't get, uh, but if I get Zoric here, I have a chance of getting my energies, which could be really nice. But I think that's being too greedy. I think that's being a little bit too greedy. can't GX for knockout either. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit awkward. Just a little bit awkward what happened here. What is that? I don't know what that noise is. I'm going to have to check something real quick. I know that's like super chat in the back or what, but that's a Streamlab noise and I don't know what it does. Yeah, I think I'm going to be okay here and just turbo drive. Two KOs, I guess.
All right, let me double check Stream Labs. I have Stream Labs open. Oh, by the way, you guys want to see something really cool that I just recently got? Let me show you guys in a second, but let me see what's going on. Uh, my account. No, I want to go to my account. Dashboard. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what that noise is. It's not Tommy. It's not a donation. It's not a subscriber. Uh, yeah, I don't know what it is. I hate that. Oh, well. I'll check it out, guys. Look at that. Look what I have. Um, let me go to this. Let me open that up and check this out. Check it out. Does anybody, does anybody here want to spin the Wheel of Fortune? Hold up. We don't have it. It's not really set up yet, but check this out. Boom. Oh, no. You guys can see it. No. No, no, no. You guys can see it. No, that was supposed to be super cool. Hold up. Boom. There it is. There it is. So I have a wheel here. I don't like the noise that it's making, but I have a wheel. So if I ever do like any crazy prize giveaways, I could turn on the wheel and just spin it whenever I want. So I'm really excited about that. <laughs> Happens to some streamers occasionally. So it's not just me. The yeah, pizza slice. <laughs> Let's get this wick. What happened? So what's he trying to do? He has three Zorks down. He has a Buzzwill, a Lycanroc. He needs DCE. Oh, he needs an Energy and a Lycanroc here. And he needs to... How, how did he retreat? What happened? What did I miss? I must have missed something. Oh, he had the Energy. Does he have the Lycanroc? Oh, that sucks. Unless he's attacking me with rock off, that'd be hilarious. Is he? Oh my god! Please do it. That's like a hundred damage. That's hilarious. So I can actually knock this out, which is good. Um, or but did he ace a roller? Is that what happened? I mean, I definitely want to knock this thing out right now. Uh, I want to ace a roller, but I can't because I already touched my energy for the turn. <laughs> He'll get a revenge knockout. I think I'm gonna lose these Guzman. I don't have any Guzman priced or Ace Roller priced, so I should have all my remaining ones in the deck. I will get Soul Valley here, just so I have another one set up. Uh, I could get Zork as well, but I'm just gonna stick with Soul Valley for now. I will go ahead and play Sycamore here. Are we doing the the Light Gold giveaway? Oh, we can do that. Sure. What's the light goal? <laughs> What's the giveaway? I don't know. I thought we already gave away all of them. Now we'll put Lele back into the hand and we'll get Sycamore with this. And hopefully we can get a bunch of stuff off Sycamore. I need energies and I need uh, Zorix. Golden Nuggets with Charles sucks. Oh, okay. What's up, Panda pa uh, Papa Panda? How you doing, big dog? You're a new face of the stream. It's sick and thick like Wick. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Let me see what I get. I got a Zoark. Ooh, I got energies. I uh, ooh, this is actually crazy nice for me. Uh, I keep forgetting about that thing. That's fine though. Got to deal with it. Uh, one. These are all the energies I have left in the deck. So we'll want to keep one for manual attachments. Uh, do I care about having 180 HP left? I don't really think I do because there's no way he can hit that number anyways. Gladion's going to be good because we have DC in the, in the discard pile. This is going to be really good as well because that's a really good GX attack of choice to use. So I want to keep that in hand. I'll just discard my energies, have a manual attachment for next turn, and go from there. Yeah, we'll just get a second Zorak here. <clears throat> at this point, I don't really need Ultra Ball, so I'm thinking about trading it away just to thin out the deck. But at the same time, I want to keep all these cards. We'll see what we get off the prizes before I make any crazy plays. But for now, we'll just turbo for knockout. We'll get revenge as if he gets a DCE, but that'll be okay. We'll be in the world. All right. Or if you do a light goal, I'll spam you with my alts. Don't do that though, that's cheating. Spam me with my alts at the end of the stream. So we got one of our draw supporters and it's actually a decent one. I want to play end soon, so. Gives you the thickness to go. <laughs> All right, relax. Just subbed on Twitch also. Hey, shout out to you, bro. Uh, I mean, I'll be streaming on Twitch a lot more in 2018 whenever I do my LPs and stuff like that, but yeah. Dude, Gladian seems like a dude. I was telling people like whenever this card first came out, right? P 
people were telling me that like his hand is not that big it's just a perception thing there's no way his hand is unnecessary there's no that's not perception bro his hand is just drawn ridiculously big for no reason it's manly it's it's like a big old meaty manly claw bro it's just, it's not natural i don't like it looks like it's my time boys i'm I actually am oh you're actually charles hey what's up bro Hyper rare lately, secret DC has nothing on this. Oh god, what's it gonna be? I know it's useless card, but it has a deep meaning within our hearts and minds. Is it, is it a wick? If this man attaches choice band, he can knock me out here. Is it, oh, oh he's, it's a full art wick giveaway. Oh, cool. All right, guys, how about this? Uh, let's make, since it's such a beautiful and amazing and sexy card, let's do a 30 six like goal if we can hit 36 likes we'll give away a full art wick he's an ace roller here which is fine with me i still don't have my uh fighting thing the cayenne chicken may join the or army dude can we hit 3,000 in a month can we hit 25 can we get 200 and like 220 more subscribers in like a month to hit our 3k like the 3k sub goal everybody if you haven't subscribed yet subscribe tell your mother tell your dog tell your aunt twice removed tell your creepy cousin tell your siblings that never talk to you to subscribe to orbomb bro because we're trying to hit that we're trying to hit that 3k like goal what happened oh yikes <laughs> I can do this. Don't do it. No, no, Heliolux, don't do it. Don't do it, bro. Please don't do it. Actually, like, I do appreciate that you're doing this for me, Heliolux, but, like, don't don't cheat. Don't don't cheat like this. <laughs> What's my opponent doing, bro? He is stuck. Oh, he got the choice man. Does he have the Diki? He does have it. Awkward. We get another knockout here, but, like, uh... You know, if I can, like, set up, buzz set up Necrozma while, uh... And then Guzma up Buzzwell. I can actually knock out Buzzwell while using my GX attack. Food for thought, my friends. Now let's go into a basic. Because we have free retreat on it. Yeah, we'll do that. We have a DC in the discard pile if we need to get it. So I'm not too worried about that. Uh, I'm just afraid that he's putting me in range too much. I don't really want to trade any of these cards away. We have plenty of Vendel energies. So I'm not too worried about it. <coughs> think we manually attach now we play end right now get rid of all those colors in his hand i know he has zorax but like i think we'll be all right uh this hand's pretty not good <laughs> this hand's pretty not good there's psychic memory Compl oh wait a minute not worthless fighting types we want that all right yeah we'll just go ahead and retreat to this we get another knockout here we'll start setting up buzzwell again i mean not buzzwell necrozma we have guzman hand right yeah dope all right we'll, t we'll turbo drive get our knockout necrozma we'll get two easy prizes later in this game all right and we can get what all the prizes metal energy we got an n in the middle energy so far so we have one metal energy left that's prized and we have an n as well okay can the, can the number pad work please there we go one and an n so we can remove the n so we have a lele dc one metal energy and a sycamore prized uh he grabbed the choice band for some reason can he knock me out strong energy plus choice band would mean he would knock me out i think i think he hits 160 that way um because that's like 60 damage plus 20 that's 80 yeah it'll be 160 so if he gets choice band strong energy here we're in an awkward place i mean i get a revenge knockout and i can try to set up a type null as well <clears throat> but it's still kind of awkward and everything gets put in range of zoric after that so i can get dc off the prizes potentially get one off the prizes of that we're going to get here we will see he did discard a dc he needs to find a strong if he wants a knockout This game is pretty intense. Don't judge me. Uh, I think we have to. I think we're gonna have to hit, uh, increase the light goal because of Heliolux cheating. But 
We'll only increase it by two. 38 likes. Did he get it? I want this full art thick, dude. You have a chance to win, bro. Hit that liggity 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 like. Yeah. And we'll be announcing the winner of the giveaway in 20 minutes. Does he have choice band in hand? Did he actually get it? Dude, that'd be wild if he actually got it. There's no way he has choice band, right? No way. Oh, we need Ace Rolla. <laughs> How many Ace Rolls are gone? We should have one more Ace Rolla left. So maybe we can draw into it, maybe? This is a, this is a super yikes, though. <laughs> this is a super yikes. Alright, he didn't get it. Whew. I'm appeased. <laughs> My heart is appeased for now. Can I top deck a Ace Arola? Or potentially trade into it. I don't know what I would trade away though because I want to keep everything in my hand. <clears throat> ah, okay. It's not an Ace Arola. Uh, what do I trade? Do I trade Ultra Ball? I think I trade Ultra Ball. I think now is the time I trade Ultra Ball. Because so I really want this Ace Roller here. That'd be just the best thing if I got Ace Roller here. Fortunately, I'm not going to get it. Let's trade away. I don't have anything I want to trade away now. Because I want to attach this for sure. Uh, this sucks. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. This sucks pretty bad. Whatever. I'll just use my GX tech. Get rid of my DC since I have one in hand now. And this should, I really hope this is, I'm pretty sure if we're doing 100 damage, so that should be 200. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. See, no, I'm pretty sure that should work, right? This attack is 100 damage, this damage is, oh, crap. I thought that said on the bench only. Bro, I messed up. Oh, I messed up hard. <laughs> See, I was under the impression that this, this didn't affect weakness or resistance on only the bench. I would have 100% just attack with the Still Valley. But at the same time, this is still fine. We get two attacks off with a Sil Valley or a Zoark, and we should be okay. But we just have to hope we don't lose before that happens. Uh, Guzma is going to be pretty bad here. Mm. All right, cool. That's good to know for the future. Now we have learned. We have learned. We have uh, we have evolved, bro. I cannot like the chat's broken again. I'm gonna have to refresh the stream. Give me two seconds, guys. Okay, it's not the best, but eh, whatever. These things happen, I guess. Let's see if this fixes the chat, though. Oh, man. I really thought that was only... like Because like, that's like, the first thing you assume, right? Uh, this damage isn't affected by weakness or resistance against anybody. So, like... I'm sorry, I was under the impression that it was only a bench Pokemon. Uh, I was incorrect. What's he getting? Did he play? So he hasn't played his board this turn, so I guess he could get Guzma here. We're going to be pretty behind. Especially if he has another strong energy, chilling. That'd be really bad for me. Because then I just lose, I think. Guzma and N. That's fine if he plays N. We both have... Uh, we both have... Uh, so we're extra days, so it's not a big deal. Let's see what he chooses to play this turn, though. There, are, there's two stronger. So we get a knockout, and we play, uh, and we play E Hammer. That's the goal. He's gonna knock out Silvalli. Perfectly fine. Um, we get our knockout here. We E Hammer that one, <clears throat> and we go from there. The thing is, though, we only have 130 HP left. Luckily, he needs a tool to knock us out because he can't just hit us for 60. Uh, which he w he can just hit us for 60, which is 120. We could also play Ace Roll if we get it this turn. So there's that benefit. Uh, we'll go into we'll go into this because we're never going to use this attack anymore, anyways. We can actually manually retreat that. <coughs> play this down there. This here because I think this is the one we're going to be attacking with. We need to start trading. Let me go ahead and e hammer this one. Choice Band doesn't really do anything. Uh, I guess we'll play it for GP, maybe. 
He'll put it down there. I'm not too sure where I want to attach this. You're not going to be able to attack easily, but you will be. Stretcher does what for me? I think Sycamore is just a dead card now. So we will trade. I mean, he will potentially end us. Uh, I mean, I already clicked trade, huh? Yikes. Um, let me trade Sil Valley. We have Stretcher in hand. Because he might end us, and getting that Sycamore could be useful. Oh, we got N. Shout outs to that. Alright, so we have N here. Which means I want to attach this now. If I N, am I going to be happy with that? Probably. Do I shuffle things back? Not yet. I think we'll be okay. Let me end for now. Okay, we definitely want to toss these fighting memories. Actually, no, we don't. Yes, we do. Uh, yes, we do. Alright, let's toss one fighting, fighting memory. We have Ace Roller for the following turn if he whips a knockout. So, there's that benefit. E Hammer is great as well. Did he just win? I guess he won. That sucks. That sucks if you won. Can't really do much about it. No, uh, that really sucks if you won. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Let's see if he won if he wins here. We got forty or forty five. We'll do we'll do forty. <clears throat> oh I will you know what? Since it's your it's your card, we can do forty five. Actually let's do it. Let's do an even number. Let's do forty two. He actually just won, didn't he? That sucks. I can't believe did I just end him into oh my, I end him into Guzma DCE. That's crazy. That's crazy, bruh. Bruh. That pull down is really annoying. So unfortunately, I end him into Guzma DCE. So, <laughs> what can I do about that, really? Uh, yikes. That's really upsetting. Alright, but that's my fault. I could have played that game way more differently. Like, I could have just took the knockout and got prizes and then took a knockout the following turn for game. Uh, if I didn't... If I didn't do the this play. So... Like, as far as I'm aware, a concern, I won that game, right? Because, like, in what would have happened, right? He didn't, not, what would have happened was, instead of me, because we were both at four prizes, right? Instead of me using this attack to put damage on the board, I, I had the Psychic Memory in hand. I had a type, I had a Silk Valley ready to attack. What I would have done is set up a Zoark and, uh, I think I would have been better, right? Set up Zoark with the with Silk Valley while taking a knockout and going for a he comes in he knocks me out i don't know maybe i wouldn't have won that game regardless but that's good, it's good it's good to know for the future it's good to know for the future it's good to know for the future all right so now i know how that works so i gotta strictly play that card for high hp matchups that i have the time to do that for cool all right so i still need to figure out what I need to do. I think the first thing I want to do is add more basic energy. Uh, hmm. I think the first thing I want to do to this deck is add more basic energy. And I think I want to take out Mallow. As much as I don't like taking out Mallow, I think it will work. It hasn't come in clutch yet. We will see. The opening hands in this deck are some sort of cheeks, bro. They are some sort of cheeks. Luckily, we can always we can always put down a basic and be okay. This opening hand isn't awful because we have a type null ready for next turn, or so value ready for the following turn. Because we can bridge it here. It's just not the best. And we're playing against fighting again, bro. This is just not my day <laughs> as far as that goes. Hopefully, we don't have bridge of prizes. Let's take a look at what's prize this game. One Ace Rolla off the bat. So, Ace Rolla. Oh, Bridget's prize. Cool. Well, yikes. Bridget. Well, this opening hand went from really good to really bad. <laughs> uh, how many? We have all of our Pokemon. From the looks of it, it looks like we have all of our Pokemon. Oh, I'm really upset about that. Um, we have a Fighting Memory Prize, a DCE, and I don't know what the other card is. I don't know. There's two more cards. Oh, we don't have a funny memory card prizes in our hand. Yeah, I don't know what the other two cards are. I don't know what the other three cards are right now. Um, I don't know what I want to get. This is really bad for me. I want more basics, so I'm gonna have to play something like N. Actually, Sycamore is decent here, just because we put Metal Energies in discard pile right now. As long as we can get cards, we're not gonna need the fighting memory. Uh, we can get things with Stretcher. Ooh, that's probably what I'm missing, huh? Some Stretchers. 
Why do you run a Bridget? Two would be better. Well, the thing is with this deck, right? Oh, this sucks. Um, one, you don't really have deck space, and I'm trying to work on it. That's the whole point where we're playing today. Uh, and two, it, this is not the kind of deck you want a bunch of basic Pokemons down right away. And uh, Bridget's kind of getting weaker and weaker in this current meta. It's because there's so many ways people can punish you. This is a little bit of a yikes, though. Uh, we might have to attack with Lele. We might have to get a couple of attacks off of Lele later. Yeah, this is, this is this is definitely a scoop, I think. This is the kind of game where I just want to scoop up. No Ultra Balls, no Bridgets. That was that's a that's a pretty big problem. What's up, Chris? Confuser, welcome back. We're playing fighting as well. I think I might just skip this game up. We'll see. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna skip this game up, guys. Sorry, I just there's just too but too much of bad luck there. Couldn't get it going. That was really annoying. That was really annoying. All right. That sucked. Let's get another game. Why do you have Malo Kazork? Bro, I'm telling you right now, just go ask any competitive player. Four, is, four Guzma is too good. And this deck is too a KO, so if they if they retreat, then you literally need to get that Pokemon back. You you need to be able to knock that one out. Um I'm not doing my loading right now, Confuser. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna have to gonna have to tell you right now. <laughs> we're working on this today. We're announcing a giveaway in ten minutes. I don't think we're gonna have no time. There we go. Much better hand. Uh, we have Bridget. We have a bunch of really good cards. Yeah, this is. If, if we get a, I wish we would go turn one more often. Because if we go turn one with this deck and like we have these style style of hands, we're just we're we're just powerful. We're so strong, and we're playing against Guardi. So. Guardian matchup. We have choice band now, so if they take one knockout, Banded Cobalion gets some delicious kills. Oh, there you go. This is exactly why I want to go first more often, bro. Uh, we have some early game pressure we can put on the board of the Zoric as well. We still get a thing here, but like it's still super awkward for me. My opponent doesn't even need to play Bridget apparently. Hmm, we have Sylvalian in hand. Let's get Cobalion, and because we have stretchers in the deck, I'm not too worried about it. We can do Cobalion, and this is two Zoras, or let's see, let's see what's prized first. We have Cobalion in the deck, luckily. Looks like we have all our Zorak line. We have all of our type nulls, but we have, no, we have all of our Sylvalians as well. All right, cool. So, wait a minute. Okay, never mind. We have, we have both Lele's as well. Let's see, we have Bridget. We have an Ace Arola prize, I believe. Yep. Ace Arola prized. Two Guzmas prized. Yikes. That's really bad. All right, so Ace Arola, two Guz. Uh, one of each draw support. No, didn't we just play N? No, we didn't. Oh, we have one Guzma. Okay, never mind. So we have one Sycamore and one Guz. Uh, let's see. We have one fire energy and one metal, I think. Yeah, one fire, one metal. So we're just missing one prize. All right, so we know five of our four. We know five of our prizes. We just need to figure out what the last one is. Um, <coughs> hmm. Is there a Pokemon I'm forgetting? Cartana. Cartana's priced. All right, there we know all the prizes now. Cartana is actually really good this matchup, so I'd like to get Cartana with the prizes because that's like a free e-hammer. Let's fill up our bench. We can get two more Pokemon. Unfortunately, only two more, but I mean that's free. Uh, these two, <laughs> so I'll take it. I just hate that we don't have any attachments for the turn, which is a super yikes. Um, but we should be okay as long as we get a DC next turn. We should be okay, because we knock out Curlias and stuff. As, as long as he doesn't get any crazy... Oh, there it is. Yep, Guardi's still broken. <laughs> Guardi is as broken as he can get. So there's that problem. 
So once you get knockouts, if I can just set up a couple metal energies onto Cobalion, Revenge Blast with Choice Man will get a knockout. Hmm. So far, I gotta make a list of what I wanna cut. So far I wanna cut Mallow for a energy. Another metal energy would be nice. Hmm. How many times are Katana kind of clutch? It is one me, probably 50% of my games. Just because, like, it's cool because your opponent tries to force a seven prize game a lot of time. Like, a good player will always try to force a seven prize game. Why is my opponent going hot right now? I don't like it. Um, <laughs> I'm not a big fan of, <laughs> of Guardian that goes hot like this. Uh, God, mm, that's so frustrating. Uh, luckily, he didn't get a knockout, but it's still super frustrating. Okay, so how are we going to do this? Uh, DCE, if I had a... Mm, mm, not too sure how I feel about this. I want to knock out some of these babies, but then I get revenged. So, I don't know. I guess I attack with Lele. I'm going to get revenged if I attack with Lele, but I think that's better than attacking with Zorak right now. So, we do the most damage. Uh, let's do this. One, two, I don't want to attach Choice Band. I want to attach it to Cobalion. Uh, I don't want to evolve into this because <laughs> it's going to get knocked out. Oh man, this is a really, really bad start. I definitely need to play more Metal Energies because like this is, this is getting kind of rough. Oh yeah, but like like when you play a 7 prize game, you just come in with Kartana GX for game. It's just, it's so good. Um, Play quad Zerk, you right. Why don't you allow such low punts here? <laughs> now we have 42 likes. All right, we'll go ahead and give away the wick after this game. Give me two seconds. <sighs> oh, man, it's tough, man. I don't know what else to do. What do you guys recommend? Everybody in the comments, start start making uh, start making arguments for cards you would add and replace. Gotta go. See you later. Good luck with those participating. Good luck. All right. Good luck. See you later, Richard. Have a good night, bro. Oh, also after this game, we have to do the giveaway as well. Oh, he just attacked me. That was weird. Um. Hmm. Well, they're both 90 HP now. Oh, he Guzman me, and we have three Sycamores in hand. That's a super yikes. All right. So I want him to eventually knock me out. Do I evolve into Silk Valley? I hate, I hate this. I'm not gonna be able. To, I'm gonna be able. I'm gonna lose next turn. I'm gonna lose very soon. <laughs> what am I talking about next turn? Yeah, I, I have the sycamore here. That really sucks. If I Guzman, I would have been okay. At least decent. This is really bad. This is super bad. Super duper bad. Uh, Cause I'm not gonna be able to attack this turn. I might as well put it here. He'll get a knockout. I get a KO. Uh, we'll start trading away these psychic memories. So I'm never gonna use them. Well, when Tai will put fear into his heart. Ace Roll is so good. We have all of our Pokemon on the bench now. I don't want to toss anything. I want a Metal Energy for next turn. I want DC to attach. Yeah, I'll just pass here. Drop four Guzma for four Y, and that's why I don't ask the chat. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, you could try playing a different deck. All right, once again, Propane is like I should just block. Every time I see Propane's name, I should just ignore it. I feel like that should be like the new thing I do. <laughs> What's up, Corey? Hello, come on. Where's the thing? I think it was. Here it is. Clean. Hey, Ori, did you ever find your gold Ultra Ball? I did not. I was really mad though, because I, I, what happened was I bought another one because, oh god, is he knocking out Kabalion? Alright, never mind. No, I'm just, I'm sorry. I'm looking at my stream thinking that that's what's happening in the game. Might be. Uh, he already knocked me out. <laughs> Yikes. Alright, so we'll get a knockout here. Hopefully we can end my opponent. Maybe, oh, no, there you go. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, it's not the best thing for me to end right now, because I want another type null down. And I could Ultra Ball, but I want to keep Ace Rolla, because Ace Roll. But if I end him, he only has four cards, and like it's really good for me. <laughs> I'm gonna end. Maybe I'll get a type null off my trades. Uh, I mean, I guess that's as good as it gets. Oh, you know what sucks? I just remembered that we need the psychic memory for the uh, Gallade, and I already tossed my only one. 
<laughs> That's what we call a yikes here in Orbomb Industries. What we don't need is the fighting memory. I had it backwards. But we can get a type null here. And, uh, hmm. I don't want to toss any metal energies because, once again, we're about to lose two more. So we have more than enough energies in the discard pile now. So I think I'm just going to Revenge Blast and hopefully he can't revenge me. But, hey, Tim oh, Timmy just donated. Here's a donation. Wishing myself luck on this entry. Hey, shout outs to you, Timmy. Bro, that's killer. Once again, the winners are announced as soon as this game ends. So if you want a chance to uh, win these awesome cards I was talking about throughout the whole stream, check the Discord if you want, if you want more information. Um, we are, well, we were 12, so now we are 7. We're $7 away from giving away a full art top of the GX as well. So we'll go ahead and... Uh, Get Timmy here for five. Shout out to you, man. I really appreciate it. Never heard of Propane. How new is he? <laughs> right? I've never heard of him either, bro. If he can't knock me out here, I can Guzma for knockout, which is just gorgeous, bro. It's just, ah, oh, my heart sings for that play. Dude, shout out. This is why I wanted to play two Cobalion in my deck. It's because of like how powerful Cobalion is in the Guardian matchup. I'm so glad I put Choice Band back. It's still like I'm still not the biggest fan of Choice Band because it's still a little bit clunky for my taste, but it's just uh, it's just working out so well. All right, but what do I trade here? I don't want to trade E Hammers. I, I, that, this isn't the other thing about this deck that I'm always super worried about because I want it. There's I want to do so much but not that much at the same time. If that makes any sense. Uh, I believe we have basics, right? So if we do this. Uh, we can do this and retreat. <clears throat> I don't want another metal energy. We're going to lose a. Actually, we have none in the discard pile right now. Uh, we'll go ahead and trade. Uh, e hammer again. Mm, I don't think I'm going to want N just because he has uh, Octillery. So even if I do N, I'm down to low hand sizes. It's still like a yikes. Gladion, I forgot my prize. No, I don't forgot my prizes. Uh, what did we grab off the prizes? I think we grabbed the medal. I don't actually remember what we grabbed off the prizes. Uh, but we can Ultra Ball away Gladion. I don't think we're going to use it this game. I really hope I don't regret that play. But I don't think we're going to use Gladion right now. We'll drop Gladion and N here. Keep the E hammers because they're really powerful. We'll finally get Soul Valley number two. And hopefully get a couple DCEs. We should have three more left. I don't think there were any prizes if I remember correctly. I believe this is a knockout. Clean. Dude, shout outs to Cobalion, bro. We got Cartana in our fire, so that's like three E hammers right there. But we're just gonna keep Guzman, because like these things have gotta go. The less Gallade slash um Guardies on the field, the better, bro. King of the Hills, my favorite anime. That's a good anime, bro. <laughs> so we just drew our other two E hammers, so that's cool, I guess. <laughs> uh, so he's gonna get Guardies down, so we need to get real lucky because we don't have any more ends. I can't end him away. Banjoy.co slash Orbum. What's that? I don't want to click it because it sounds scary. <laughs> but he's not putting down any Glades this matchup, which is very strange, but I'll take it. I don't want any Pokemon back this game. Because we're about to wrap up this game anyways. <clears throat> I want Guzma. That is not a Guzma. Oh, do I toss another one? I don't want to toss E-Hammers because I know they're going to come in clutch. He still needs to take four more prizes. I think we trade the Choice Band. Yeah. We haven't gx yet though. So having a Choice Band on Savali for a powerful GX could be really nice. So, I think we trade the stretcher. I think we just trade the stretcher. I don't think we need stretchers, bro. Something tells me we really don't need stretchers this game. So, if I get another Guzma here, we'll be set. If I don't get another Guzma, I just have to get Guzma eventually. Okay, DC is good. Um, DC is definitely not bad by any means. I just hate that we don't have what I want. I want to hold on to the thing, because if he ends me next turn, I can... Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let me just revenge blast here. 
So he has three Pokemon down. Hmm. We got Sycamore. That's good. I just came to here to hang out with Ori. That's my boy, Papa Panda. A.K.A. the... Charles, I think. Uh, that's, you're, that's Charles, right? Being the luck plays League of Legends. Dude, League of Legends is pretty cool. I, I don't play it myself just because, like, it's one of those games I know I'll get addicted to and must avoid addictions at all to cost. <clears throat> How many Guzmans are left, by the way? I didn't even check. Uh, we have two more Guzmans left. Guzma literally wins me the game. So if I can get Guzma here. Actually, I win the game. Oh, I should have attached my choice band. Uh, I was thinking about not attaching it just in case. Because um, I want I might want to attach it to a different Pokemon. But uh, we're in a pretty awkward pickle right now. Oh, he's in a Sycamore. Oh, I think I win then. Because he plays down all the Pokemon. We have choice band in hand. So now so if I always hits 230 with his GX attack. So I think we win. Unless, of course, he... No, there's no way. Unless he plays E-Rope. Well, if he plays E-Rope, I just don't bring out my Soul Valley. All right, so we win. No matter what, we GX for game. That's of course super scoop up. That'd be the most awkward thing. Could you imagine? <laughs> Could you imagine? I got XY Premium Trainer Kit and FLR and Shaman and all the other stuff and it comes in with it on TCGO. Dude, I really want it, but like, uh, shout outs to. Um, wow, I'm sorry. I just had just got a text real quick. Shout out to Carl, by the way, though. Carl said he's gonna hook me up with the trades for all the cards, but the end, which would be just beautiful if he does. We'll see. Um, but he said he's gonna he's gonna give me everything from the boxes. He's getting a second box, but he wants to give me everything but the end, because of course, end and his end. If he does pull that off, and we do manage to work out a trade, I am so excited because that means I don't have to buy the box. I get everything I want from the boxes. I already have three floor ends. Did he whiff it? <laughs> no, this is a knockout, never mind. <clears throat> yep. Shout outs to Sil Valley, bro. There we go. So we lost all those awkward games, but we won the most important one. Boom. Anyways, okay. So for the for the real quick like, real quick like, we're going to do the uh Full Art Wick Giveaway. What just happened? Why did this... That was weird. Um, We're going to do the Full Art Wick Giveaway. So, the common question of the day is, who is your favorite Poke Girl? Any female in the Pokemon, uh, in the Pokemon universe, who is your favorite one? I'm a personal... Personally, mine is Cynthia. Cynthia has my two favorite Pokemon on her team, uh, Lucario and Togekiss. Uh, she's probably the best champion. She has the most competitive team, as far as champions go. And, dude, if she ever comes back with, like, a Mega and a Z-move, bro, she'd be the most OP one. Imagine a Mega Lucario. She'd probably have Mega Garchomp, which is sad. But if she doesn't have some Mega Garchomp and she has Mega Lucario, that'd be the best. Because, could you imagine? Dude, Mega Lucario is broken. <laughs> I'd give, get, like, Z-move Garchomp, bro, it'd be, like, VGC. That'd be so clean. So, mine's, mine is, uh, mine is Lady, mine is Lady Cynthia. If you, let me know what yours is with the hashtag Pokegirl. So don't forget to add the hashtag Pokegirl to it in the chat. <clears throat> in the chat, when I get back, I will pick a winner. I'm going to go quickly use the restroom. So BRB, people. Oh, I forgot I moved it there for our, <laughs> for our tournaments. There we go. BRB, people.
All right, guys, we are back. Okay, so uh, I bring the luck. Do me a favor and pick a winner for the Fall Wick for me. A random winner that commented with the hashtag. Please and thank you. Who's Jimmy? It's my boy. Oh, he just entered multiple. Yeah, don't enter multiple times, of course. Uh, uh, but can you pick a winner for me? Uh, I bring the luck. And I'm going to go ahead and start setting up the monthly giveaway. If there's any last minute donations, now would be the time to do it. If you want a chance to win, we're really close. We are with the thing. We are seven dollar we are a seven dollar donation away from a full art tapu lele being given away in the pool. But today I'm gonna write down all the cards we're giving away so far. Let me go to collection. Uh gotcha big dog. Let me actually put a wick for trade while I'm here. Uh, it's in trainers, that's right. That was already for trade, that's, that works out then. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and write down all the cards you're giving away. So first things first, I'm not going to write this down in order of like good cards, I guess. Uh, we did not reach the top of boom. That's really sad. We're so close. Let me go ahead and go to Orbomb. Let me check the the thing. We will be doing Secret Rare DCE, SR, DCE, uh, HR, Zoro Arc. I'm going to have to make an order for him. Um, we did not hit Full Art Lele so far. Um, or we did because my bro... <laughs> My bro Bad Crow just donated seven dollars, bro. Dude, shout outs to that. Okay, so now we have reached Tapu Lele Full Art. Let me go ahead and put down seven dollars for for a Bad Crow. Dude, shout outs to you, bro. Tapu Lele Full Art. That's gonna be the big one. Uh. Uh, and as far as everything else, let me double check. Uh, we're gonna give away a. We're gonna do Full Art Soul Valley, I think. Just for the time being. Uh, just because I don't have three yet. <laughs> or regular arts at all. Yeah, we're good. Okay, so I think this should be it. We have the dark SR and the metal SR as well. Let me make sure I'm putting everything for trade. Um, so Valley for trade. The Zoro Arc. Um, I'm gonna check the chat one second, guys, to figure out who the Wick winner is. Give me two seconds. Lele, trade, <clears throat> and then everything else is energies, um, filters, boom, apply. Let me make sure this is all for trade. Dark is for trade, DCE is for trade, and metal is not for trade, so we'll do that. All right, cool. So we have, I believe, six prizes to give away. One, two, three, four, five, six. yeah, six prizes to give away. We're going to be giving them away in the order from obviously the most wanted to the least wanted. There's from the least wanted to the most wanted. But before I forget, I'm going to go ahead and quickly put in all of my sponsors for the month for their $5 entries that they all deserve for being a sponsor. Um, so give me two seconds to do that. While I'm doing that, let me double check the chat to see who won the full art wick as soon as it would, you know, pop up for me. Thank you. All right, Landstorm wins. Hey, shout out to you, bro. Go ahead and offer me a trade for the Full Art Wick whenever you're ready. Um, but guys, if you haven't already, drop a like on the stream. It's always greatly, greatly appreciated. The Wicker of the win is... All right, shout out to you, Landstorm. It's very, very appreciated. Landstorm has been ch chilling in the in the uh, chat a lot more often. So, of course, my boy. I'm very happy for my boy for winning this. Okay, community. I believe it's in community. Dude, I wonder if my Mega Guardi video is monetized now. It doesn't matter because I lost all the viewers. I would have gotten for it. All right, sponsorships. Let's see who all is sponsored. So this month, oh, we have Dennis sponsored, but I'm not giving anything to Dennis. Dennis doesn't need anything. <laughs> we got Nico for five. I don't think she donated yet this month. So Nico for five. Um, we got Blake. Who already donated five this month, so this actually works out very nicely. Uh, so Blake is at ten entries. 
as soon as I can edit it. Cool. I don't think Sam. I haven't seen Samuel in a minute, so I really hope he comes back. Uh, I don't think Samuel's doing it either. All right. We already got that one put down. Samuel for five. Uh, Joey for five. Joey, let me put down Joey Star just so I don't forget. Um, Nebby for five. Do shout out to Nebby. Nebby being the the best Nebby out there for five. And we got, of course, the the king himself, Pat, who already donated two dollars, is now at seven entries. Uh, edit. Boom. All right. Let me go ahead and count this up. So we're gonna be doing this in order of the people that donated on um, on the accounts uh, on the on the Discord. So if you guys want to see who uh, what order you're in, it'd be the order of the Discord. Just hit my desk. I apologize about that, but we have let's see twenty. 30, 37, 57, 67, um, 67 plus 5 is 72, 77, 84, 88, 88 plus 10 is 98, plus 6 is 104, 109, <clears throat> 114, 119, 124, 120. So we have 129 en entries all together. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and go to the Google uh, Go random number generator Nope, didn't want to type random number generator All right, let me go ahead and see if this shows up now chrome clean there it is. All right, let me remove the chat for the time being Just so you guys can see everything No, boom all right. So, once again, I do want to apologize. I do want to apologize for those that don't win, because you. I want everybody here to win. You guys have always been super duper, just so so helpful. You guys need to understand that this money helps me live. So you guys mean the world to me. Whenever you guys donate like this, obviously just not just coming to the stream and liking and subscribing and viewing and sharing all that stuff just means so much. But for those of you that go the extra mile to donate, I do want to thank you. Like in a personal, but if I could hug all of you, you would all be super hugged. All right, <clears throat> all of you would be super hugged. I can't make the trade. I'm not. I'm not your TCG friend. Just friend me, bro. Um, if you haven't friended me yet, let me. No, just go ahead and friend me. I don't think my. I don't think my friend list is full right now. But just in case, I'll delete like two random people. Uh, like this, uh, Bonio. Nah, more like a Nonio. Get out of my face. And this guy, Craig. <laughs> Who likes anybody named Craig? Am I right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, all right. So we have 126 people. So how the 126 entries? I should say. So how this works is that for every like, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just go open the Discord real quick. All right. So the first 20 entries is gonna be Lupe. So for instance, I'm gonna give a I'm gonna give a pre-roll right before. This is this is not count obviously this roll will not count i do apologize if this lands on you but <clears throat> 129 we roll it's 30 right so whoever is the person that donate the 30th dollar let me go ahead and do this um is the person are, are you synchro land by the way let me know let me know who you are i'm gonna minimize this for the time being though um so whoever's only the 30th dollar like for instance right the first 20 dollars was lupe but the next 10 dollars is blake so if that were to be the real roll, Blake would have just barely won with his final $10 donation. So that would be an example. Um, now, for, as far as the order of things that we're going to be winning here, the first prize we're giving away is Full Art Sil Valley. All right. After that is going to be, and you can only win one prize. I do apologize. We will be removing you from the giveaway after you've won, won a prize. <clears throat> um... Uh, so the next prize after that will be, we'll do a uh, metal secret rare, a dark secret rare after that, a hyper Zoroark after that, a Tapu Lele full art after that, and secret rare DCE after that. So DC will be the last prize. I don't know if there's like all equates to like most valuable to least valuable, but that's going to be how it works. Um, I've typed it down so I don't forget, but let me double check the chat before we do this roll because I get really nervous when I start rolling. Your synchro, all right, cool. So go ahead and offer me the trade, bro. All right, 
Okay. All right. Oh, man, I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm super nervous. Everybody, if anybody wants to make any last-minute donations, go ahead. I'm super nervous, though. <laughs> I, don't, I hate to see my friends. I love to see my friends win and then hate to see my friends lose as well. So it's just like, oh, uh, man. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. It's, I always get super nervous when this happens. Okay, something's right. All right. So last minute donations, I'm going to go ahead and accept this trade. And uh, I'll do it from there. Oh god, it's super nerve-wracking, bro. It's super nerve-wracking. I don't know if this is the person that won the bodybuilder dumbbells. So I haven't accepted it yet because I'm waiting for that person. Uh, this man keeps draining me from Caterpies, bro. There you go, my, I actually don't have this card yet, so that's kind of cool. Thank you, dude, for entering the giveaway and just being an awesome person to join the stream. <sighs> Boy Aura. I was here when Gabby was modded. When Gabby was modded. <laughs> What's happening with the chat? Okay. Hmm. Well, yeah, almost, we're at 45 likes almost. That's crazy. At a house show, can't. All right, see you later, bro. Thank you for dropping by, and I appreciate the support. All right, I think I'm over it. I don't think we're getting any more donations. This is it. This is it. This is one of the lowest donation months, but one of the best rewards we're giving away for the crazy. I don't know what I'm gonna give away next month. I still don't know, bro. I think we we'll give away secret counter catcher. I think we might just bite the bullet and give away a hyper rare, hyper rare top lele. <clears throat> we will see. All right, so this is gonna be the first roll for. The Full Art Soul Valley. Oh god, I'm so nervous. Oh man, I'm so sorry. The next giveaway question. What is the strangest Christmas present you have ever gotten? Ooh, that's a good one. For the next giveaway question, that's a good one. Uh, I like that one. Okay, so the first one is going to be... 36! <laughs> is that the person right after Bad Crow? It is. It's Dog. Oh my god! He doesn't play TCG. He just donates for the fun of it. I know who that is. That's my boy, Doug. Wow. Um, I might re-roll for that. I might re-roll for that one. For now, I won't. I'm, I'm going to PM him later. But Doug has won. Uh, I know who that is, so I'll PM him later. But he won the Tapu. He won the Full Art one. So he's out of the giveaway. Which means if we roll his number, we will go ahead and re-roll. But Full Art Silva is given away to my boy, Doug. He's a friend of uh, Ali J. He comes and just randomly donates because he's a good guy. Okay, so that's the first one. So <clears throat> now it gets to the good stuff. The secret rare stuff. Up next is the secret rare metal energy. So are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Uh, Dennis is overrated. Watch Dennis whenever you give away. <laughs> I think that's how it works. <laughs> Dennis is not part of the giveaway, guys. Don't worry. Uh, we'll go ahead and generate and 124 we have 129 giveaway which means it's the second to bottom one which means it's actually a sponsor the perks of being a sponsor means my boy joey star is that joey star that is exactly joey star because that's five away so five six seven eight nine yeah that's joey star. all right so joey shout out to joey um also has a youtube channel uh joey star actually wins the secret medal so he's out of the tournament as well as dog so that's good. Um, good for organizing, I mean, not because that they're out of the tournament or anything like that. Or the giveaway, I should say. Or oh, I was in Discord, there it is. I think Salsa watches Yeah, Salsa doesn't watch me anymore, bro. Well, he doesn't really watch Pokemon content in general. I know he's told me that multiple times. But anyways, for now, this one is for the Secret Rare Dark Energy. And that's going to be number 33. Who is that? That's not Dog this time, I think. No, it, no, no, it is dog, right? 20, 30, yeah, it is. Okay, so we're going to re-roll. All right, we'll re-roll for that one. 116. Ooh, that's going to be a rough one to figure out. Uh, 116, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That should be in one of the sponsor areas. So we go minus 5, that's 124, 119. Oh, I think that's Timmy. I think that's Samuel, I mean. Is that Sam? I think that's Sam. Minus 10 is uh, 119. Between 72 and 116. So Samuel actually wins the Secret of Dark Energy. It's my boy Samuel. Dude, these sponsors are getting the business right now. Shout out to the spawns. Don't forget to sp uh, sponsor if you haven't already, guys. We're three of sponsors away from a new emote. So shout out to that. 
If you're sponsored, go ahead and put that email in the chat. <clears throat> Roll number 57, I donated 69 cents. <laughs> Exactly. Wait a minute, wait, what? Hold on, Joey has something wrong? It's not Joey. Is that Joey? Did I mess up? No, that's Nebby, bro. Nebby has, uh... Nebby has, uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Joey is right before, Joey is right before Nebby. Uh, propane. But anyways, yeah, I'm doing this right. Dude, don't scare me. I thought I did that wrong. So now for the big one, the hyper rare Zoroark. Ooh, this one's going to be nerve-wracking. Let me just keep up with the chat and make sure they're not saying I'm doing anything else wrong. Uh, yeah, my name on my name on Discord is just Orbom. Uh, okay, so hopefully it's not another sponsor. I want, like, a donator to actually get it. And the hyper rare Zoroark is... 69. <laughs> I mean, uh, just it's 69. Uh, nothing too inappropriate. Who has the lucky number 69? 20, 30, 37, 57. It's BK, I think. No, it's not. That's 67. Hold on, let me. 20, 30, 37, 57, 67. Oh, it's Bad Crow. I'm, I'm doing this, right? 20, 30, 37, 57, 67. Bad Crow wins with a $5, I'm telling you guys, the donations, it doesn't matter how big or small you do it, a $5 donation got him a hyper rare Zoark. It's that simple, guys. When I say that the small, the smaller donators always seem to win, I mean it. Uh, Bad Crow, my boy, just won the hyper rare Zoark. If any of you guys are watching this, and just be sure to PM me uh, and everything like that, I'm, what I'm going to do for this one is just because I want to do these giveaways again at some point. Uh, you have to PM me. You have to let me know that you won. And uh, after that, I'll trade with you. So be sure to do that if you did win this stuff. I have a note of everybody that did win. And I'm going to put it on the Discord if you did win. But uh, if you don't come up to me in like a week, the giveaway is pretty much null and void for you. And I do apologize. We'll give them away the following month to other donators. I uh, just want to make that out there because I know I've had a lot of people bother me about that. Like, I've had somebody come and say, like, oh, I won this card like three weeks later. I was like, bro, that's just not how it works. <laughs> that was Dwayne Johnson. Demonted. It's me. Well, I guess so. That would be cool. Hey, my boy Bad Crow is even here. My boy, go ahead and offer the trade right now, Bad Crow. Let's get you that Hyper Azoric, my dude. But, anyways, now for the Tapu Lele Full Art. The winner. For the Tapu Lele Full Art, bro. That's so dope. Oh, we're giving away Tapu Lele Full Art. Dude, thank you guys all so much for the donations this month. This, you guys killed it this month. You guys have really, really helped support me. I cannot thank you guys enough. I just can't. I just can't thank you guys enough. Appreciate the... <laughs> uh, hmm... Okay, the Tabu Lily Fire. It's Dennis. <laughs> Dennis the Menace, bro. Dennis the Menace. Let's uh, generate. Uh, I'm so nervous. I don't want to look. I'm not looking. Is that is that is that dog? <laughs> I think that's dog. All right, so we have to reroll. Right, I'm not. I'm gonna close my eyes again. I can't look. Ah, it's number sixty. Oh my goodness. This one has to be my boy BK, right? 20, 30, 37, 57. That one is my boy, BK, with the $10 donation, winning the Fuller Tapu Lele. And now for the big one, the Secret Rare DCE. Let me go check the chat to see all the disappointment. <laughs> I feel bad. Uh, that literally won every single card. You're right, bro. BK won them all, bro. Oh, you mean oh, you mean dog? Yeah, dog is one. If I just if I made it to where like you could win as many times as you want, he would have won every card, bro. That randomizer, my dude. <laughs> he doesn't even play Pokemon. I'm pretty sure he doesn't even play Pokemon. It's crazy. Uh, but anyways, the secret rare DC, the final card this month, and I think the one that's worth the most. So if you get this, you could always trade for your Lele. You know what I mean? Uh, but. 
Uh, 76. Who is 76? Ooh, it's time to count. We got Lupe at 20. Black Taylor would make it 30. Dog at 37. Steven at 57. BK at 67. Bad Crow at 72. Aliam at 77. Aliam won. And Secret DC with a simple $5 donation. Poor Pat right below him. <laughs> All right. So once again, a lot of these people, they don't really come to stream that often. So hopefully they do come to stream to pick up the rewards. If not, you guys have another chance to win the stuff next month. Do not do not fret. Do not worry. <clears throat> um, I will go ahead and post this on the Discord here. Boom, bam. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end the stream next month. Let's see. I believe we're going to be giving away... Hyper Rare Tapu Lele. Do peep the Discord if you guys want to see what you could win next month. We have lots of things we're going to be messing around with. So do not fret. Do not worry. Lots of things are coming a your way. Drop a like if you have not already. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Tell all your friends to subscribe. You know, any TCG players, bro. Just go to your local league. Slap down your tablet. Go to orbomb.com, even though it's not there. YouTube.com slash orbomb. Show them my Mega Guardy video. I don't know, it's a good video. My, my audio levels are clean um, in that video, by the way. And most of my videos nowadays are just pretty dope. Um, show them that. Tell them subscribe. Tell them it's you have a chance of winning cards and live streams and things like that. Who knows? Tell them cool things. Let them know that we are here. We are taking over YouTube. We're trying to hit that 3K by the end of this year. I'm going to give it away. All right, cool. Let me actually let me actually show you guys that these these trades, bro. These trades are not a these things. These trades are not a hoax. These are real trades. Let's just load here so I can give away this beautiful hyper rare, uh, hyper rare Zoark once it loads. <laughs> there it is. What is this? World champion. Is this you? I feel like that is you. Orbom is getting an incinero. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh. <laughs> Let's uh let's do this. Thank you. Um fastest growing channel on YouTube, you know it. Bad crow, this is your this is you, right? Just wanna double check. Yeah, dude, I'm the same, bro. If you guys want a really clean playmat, it's twenty two dollars this week. So you guys know right now, on sale for Black Friday week. Ah, right, that is you, alright, cool. Just wanna double check. Don't wanna give away a card to like a random alt. <laughs> Look at this. That's so cool. I actually don't have this stuff, so that's actually super dope. Except, boom, bam, shablam. There we go. There we go. And uh, before I forget, I do want to actually go to deck manager. I want to do. I do want to take out that mallow for metal energy. <clears throat> I do like the way the deck plays a lot. I just have to keep playing it. Boom. We might take out an N. I found myself barely using Ns. <laughs> so I might take out an N just because we have Zoarks anyways. Maybe add a second bridge or something. <sighs> we can't oh you can't oh you guys can see the screen. Uh crap. Um the but that's awkward. Um that's super awkward. <laughs> that's that's actually crazy awkward. Uh Chrome. I just took out the Silvalli thing. Can I show the trade? Is that a thing I can do? Uh new private trade offer. Can I show it? Trade complete. There it is. I can show that, right? So this trade complete should be this one? Hey, there it is. Trade complete. That's what happened. <laughs> there you go. I'm not lying, I promise. I'm a, I'm a honest per I'm an honest person. Regardless, though, drop a like if you haven't already. Subscribe to all the good jazz. I'm going to open up some things here just because I think I have. Not this. I don't want to open up that. I want to buy that Entei thing because I have enough coinage for it. I did give away the wick. You guys saw that already as well. Uh, oh, no. Is it gone? What is this? No, it's not gone. But what is this? Uh, this contains two black and white booster packs. I don't, don't think black and white is good, if I remember correctly. But I want this because I don't have one. So I think I might just get it for the sake of getting one. So I'm, I'm going to do that right now, actually. And then next time I'll get this Entei because the Entei's are the ones I want. But I don't have this card yet, so for the sake of collection. I will go ahead and open up this one beautiful pack here. Or these two beautiful packs, I should say. Come to me. <clears throat> yeah, black and white's pretty bad. But like whatever, I gotta get it. I gotta get the promo. 
let me go ahead and post these actually on the Discord wall while it's loading. Um, winners are boom. Oh, whoops, I have to edit that real quick. Um, edit, shift, there we go. I will announce next month's giveaway soon on the Discord, so be sure to follow. Check out the Discord, and I'll probably make like put it on live stream tomorrow. But we got Samurai. Pretty lame. Pretty lame. We should have maybe one or two other locked packs that we can open as well. Just because we've been grinding the ladder a little bit. Let's get this money. Boom. Sinchino. Alright, that was pretty garbage. Let's see what else we got. Uh, yeah, we have one locked pack. We also have this. You get two different servines in one pack, bro. That's because me and servines, bro. I'm all about that snake life, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> bro, my eyes are burning me, and I gotta get to bed. Because I'm tired and I have work tomorrow. No, I don't have work tomorrow. They canceled my job. Alright, so hopefully I can get some videos recorded tomorrow. Crimson Invasion. Lupe, check the Discord. We have all the winners there. We just finished, we're about to end the stream now. We have a powerful two hour stream tonight. <clears throat> and we have opened up nothing good, but that's fine. We don't need anything good. We had a good stream today. Today was a pretty good stream. Shout out to all you guys. Uh, and I will see you guys tomorrow with another live stream. Hopefully viewer matches. Peace.